hey guys welcome back to my channel it is morning time right now it is like i think yeah it is actually 10 30 on the dot so um today i'm going to be retouching my hair doing my second lift so um i did my first lift well it's been almost two weeks and i'm gonna just go ahead and lift um certain parts not all of it this is how light i got my entire head when I got towards the front, I only left it on for like 15 minutes. I got tired um, of standing, and then also I uh, just didn't want to damage my hair too much. Also, there's some parts that I'm going to be going in on the roots. So I'm just going to be doing all of that today so that I can do my last lift. And um, yeah, I already got my bleach and oil slightly mixed. I just had to put my developer. Now I'm going to use 30 volume and I'm not going to be processing for that long. Roots lift easy, so I'm just going to go ahead and go in on my roots last. I'm going to start in the front and then just work my way throughout wherever else I feel like I need to uh, apply the bleach. I completed my whole top. So it's already turning. Now I'm just gonna go all throughout my roots and lighten up what I need to lighten.
little. So I'm gonna let my roots process. I'm gonna leave everything on for about 20 minutes. I'm about to put a plastic bag over my head. So it's been about 20 minutes. Um, this is where we are in the front. The front is gonna be a lot lighter than the, the back, but I didn't want to put bleach all over because the back had got processed a lot more than the front, so I wasn't gonna do that. wash my hair and then I'll come back I just want you guys to know I'm not professional um, you know even though I do you know what I'm doing but I am NOT professional um, I do suggest you seeking a professional to do this I know I do show you the steps and like what you can do but I I've been doing hair for a while and when it comes to coloring I do know what I'm doing I just wanted to show you how light I got with only two lips of bleach in my hair so this is how light we got the hair right now this is where we are so it's really nice um and i haven't even put toner on my hair yet So just finished washing out the shampoo. Um, just trying to get a little bit more water out of my hair. You can see it's pretty light. So right now I'm about to be toning my hair. Make sure you have some gloves. I'm gonna be toning with the Wella T18. I like using T18. I think last time I used it for myself was a long time ago, but it wasn't when I was trying to go for the color that I'm trying to get. So um, I'm going to be using this entire bottle because I have a lot of hair. And I'm going to be using 20 volume developer. Let's get to it. Let's reveal the hair while we do this. Oh my gosh, my hair smells so good. how it looks right now. And if you're wondering, these straight ends is is he damaged? I was going to the Dominican. Um I don't know, about every two months. I was going all the time and I just was straightening my hair a lot. So I'm gonna be cutting all of my heat damage off soon. I'm gonna be doing that on camera. So yeah. It's the bag of the roots. I really like this, how it's not like black, but it's like, I think it's right here. Yeah. So this is how it looks.
put the toner all over. I'm gonna let this sit for about 15, 20 minutes because I don't want to leave it on too long. But um, this is how it looks after the toner is on there. It's a really, really strong smell. I'm just trying to gather it through every piece of my hair. But I mean, even if I don't get all of it, it's fine. So I just finished getting out the shower. I, um, my kids are cleaning. But I want to show the result. Let me take out the ponytail. Cause it's actually pretty tight. So this is how the color came out. It came out really good. It came out just how I wanted it. It matches my husband's. So I'm very pleased with how it turned out. I only lit, I only left the toner on for about, I want to say about 15, 20 minutes. It was about 20 minutes. I think I showed the color uh, purple that it was before I actually started to um, rinse it off. But I left it on there for that long. And then I went ahead and did a silicone mix. Put the silicone on my hair for about five, 10 minutes while I was in the shower. And my hair feels really, really soft and conditioned. Now I'm going to be using Mo Nose Care, the curl smoothing pudding. And this stuff is really good at hydrating. And I feel like if you're gonna be bleaching your natural hair, after you do something like that and your hair is clenched really good, I feel like this is a really good product. I was really happy and excited to try it and give her some love, you know, knowing that I have curly hair. Um, this is how it looks. It, it moves a little bit, um, but it's really nice. I, and it smells so good, oh my God. You can smell this stuff from like a mile away, like seriously. My husband even has been using it, so. I'm gonna be using that to moisturize my hair, but this is the this is the finished result. My hair was soaking wet; it was so long, but now it's shrinking up because it's drying. But the color. I'm very pleased with the color. Um, I'm just very happy. So, yeah. Now. Next update, my hair is actually gonna be different again. I'm just not doing, I'm not doing anything like drastic or anything, but stay tuned for that. And if you haven't already, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. If you wanna see the next thing I'm gonna be doing to my hair, not anything chemical related to get me bald, cause you know, I don't wanna be bald and pregnant. That's not cute. I'm not saying that bald people who are pregnant not cute, so. Y'all all beautiful, everybody who's pregnant and bald, you're gorgeous. So yeah. Before I leave, come back on here with my eyebrows because I know this color does make me look like ball face Leisha. 
and I don't have eyebrows like when I get pregnant my face swells up and my eyebrows it's like they sink in and they disappear so I just want to show how I look with my eyebrows and the new color so now I'm about to just start moisturizing my hair and everything and so yeah I, just, I literally I just wanted to show my eyebrows so don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you all for watching. And stay tuned for what I'm going to be doing next to my hair. I already toned it and everything. So I'm just going to be moisturizing for the next couple of weeks. Making sure I retain all of my moisture and everything like that. But I do have some other stuff that I'm going to be doing. So follow me on Instagram at Lee Natural. And keep up with me in the color. Thank you. Alright, thanks guys. I will catch you in the next one.